what's good legends i am back with another video wow two videos in one day well you're going crazy out here look if you guys haven't seen my reaction video and this is one of the first videos you've seen i'm gonna leave a call of action at the end of this video this video not that long so make sure you go check out my reaction video and uh yeah go crazy you feel me now let's talk about what we came here to talk about you know what i'm saying after you guys drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more apex content all right all right all right now let's talk about this ramper apex legend season six boosted all right look if you can't loot it build it you feel me we're gonna build it look now i've always said respawn has been great respawn is a great development team their only problem i've always said it i've said it on stream multiple times i don't know if it's the publisher i don't know if it's the person that's had a charge but the biggest problem for respawn is the lack of content when it comes to pushing it out in in in, in time it's too it's too long of a period with with no content all right but when they do come with content oh they come and they come hard so no yeah don't don't think of it like that but anyway let's keep it going um if you can't loot it build it discover new pathways to victory in season six and show them what you're made of now um like i said i already reacted to this trailer so if you guys want to check it out uh description and link uh link in the description below and i'll leave a call to action at the end of the video and oh my baby she is mm, mm, bad all right let's keep going rampart an expert modder who made her name in the underground fight clubs, Rapper talks big and has ballistics to back it up. Now, that's the new legend we're getting. Apex. Hey, look. She got the big buck, the buckahoozas. Now, I will make a video talking about her kit. I will not talk about that in this video, but expect a video real soon within the next one to two days about her kit. And we're going to talk about it and discuss it. Now, we got another battle pass. Now, I'm liking season six already so far, right? When we got to World Edge Season 3, it was colorful, it was nice, then Season 4 came, it was dark, dull, and now they're coming back with the light, baby, with the color, making it colorful, attracting all the people, and I'm really digging it. So, I will say I'm digging, I'm ready for Season 6 to come, and a new thing that got me, get, uh, grabs my attention is Hollow Sprays. What the world is Hollow Sprays? now do we get the spray paint buildings that we go by now that that'd be cool i don't think it's something i would really do that often but it'd be cool or um is it like custom spray trails in the sky i don't know but if we can spray walls that'd be fun i i, I don't know how many times i would actually do it but it would be fun to do um what else introducing crafting don't like your gear collect materials around the map and build something better now I'm assuming this is going to be for every legend able to do this. Now, I wonder, do you have to go to a station to craft something? Or can you just craft something anywhere? Or can you only craft if you have Rampart on your team and she has to set up like a little shop? Now, there's a lot of questions that go along with crafting. But but I will say this. If I can take an alternator and a P2020 and make an R99, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I am satisfied and very happy and pleased with this because the, or i could take a mozambique and make an eva 8 because god knows i get like three mozambiques every time i fucking land excuse my language i'm sorry hey bleep it out you know what i'm saying hey but anyways uh so yeah crafting would be interesting to find out how that works out um i hope it's not anything like the treasure chest where you just stuff just keep popping out the loot bins it's like i ain't gonna lie that gets annoying especially now that the quest is over all right anyways rank six Rank season six, build your rep climber and eh, rank is rank. But I do like this predator uh gun charm and I low key kinda wanna grind to it, but I need a team of dogs. Roof monsters. Roof is gonna carry me to victory. Cause I can't do it myself. Alright, I'm done. I'm done talking. I'm done. I'm done with this. Alright. Ooh. Ooh. We got a new gun, baby. The vault is here charging a battle with this energy smg that packs a punch now if you guys haven't watched my titanfall uh one walkthrough um i will be dropping another titanfall 2 video starting next week i'm gonna take this time to redo my stream and get some video ideas together and but i will be continue the titanfall 2 series so um yeah the vote is a titanfall 2 gun 
And I've been saying since like season four that the SMG category is is is, is a landslide. It is no it's R99 Prowler. You can't and I mean it recently just bumped RE45 up, but even then, it's still R99 Prowler. Go to SMGs. You can try alternator, you're gonna get smacked. You can, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. So I'm glad that we got a energy SMG within a vault. And I'm trying to see how this is going to change the meta right here. I guarantee you. I guarantee you this gun right here is going to change meta, baby. Meta. Now, the only question I do have about this gun. How long will, how long will be the charge up time? Because you know for the Havoc, it's a charge up time. How bad would the recoil be? Because if it's like in Titanfall 2, that gun barely has any recoil and it's shred. So I'm really excited for this gun and I, I can't wait to play with it. Um, Yeah, but if you guys enjoy this video, don't forget, drop a like, subscribe to the channel and uh, comment down below if you're ready for this vote, SMG. Also, also do me this one favor. If you guys have a Twitch, go follow me on Twitch. Link will be in the description below. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. It's all an illusion. Which way I'm gonna go? Which route am I choosing? Feeling like I'm lost. Signs get confusing.